Hello everyone. We are back to traveling full time after about two months in the States. Mm -hmm. And our first stop was New Zealand. So we've been here for a little less than a week. We haven't been filming because I had some work to catch up on and we needed to get some planning for what we're gonna do on this trip. Uh, but today's kind of one of our first big adventures since we've gotten here. Yeah, we're on the South Island and the Northern part of the South Island, Abel Tasman National Park and we rented some kayaks so that we can explore this just beautiful beaches and bays and some of the trails. Yeah, so this national park doesn't have any roads that go into it. So your only options are to hike or take a boat. And so we took a boat into uh, the national park um, and they brought us and our kayak and now we're going to be kayaking back out of the park over two days. Yeah, so we right now are in Ani Tahuti uh, Bay and it looks really beautiful. So I think we're gonna take a swim, maybe go back and check out some of the trails, hang out here before we actually jump into our kayaks. Get in that water. Guess that means it's my turn. Water is not warm. I mean, it's not cold, but it's not super warm either. Woo, it's cold. All right, we are headed out to Shag Harbor. Say hello, Zach. What's up? Can't let ourselves get capsized. I think we made it to Shag, Har Shag Harbor. There's not much there. I think it's probably more in high tide. So a seal has been spotted, or seals, and he's just playing around. I don't know if he's gonna show up very well. We're not supposed to get super close. Oh. Is he gonna try to hop on? He was just looking straight at us, or she, and almost came really, really close to the kayak, then I think decided that we were not in danger, <laughs> and swam away to have a little bit of privacy. So we're gonna see what we see anymore. seals are really cute. There's like six or seven of them, but they've seemed a little scared. So we want to give them their space and we're going to keep moving on, checking out what else there is to see uh, before we hit our campsite tonight. In our campsite for the night, uh, it's not completely low tide, but it's lower tide. So we're going to have to drag it quite a bit but we're getting sort of close. So we got to our campsite. Now it's time to set up the tent. Now that we set up our camp, it's time to cook some dinner. Mm, Aweka, Aweka? These little thieves have been watching us, looking for a chance to strike. We turned away for like two seconds and they get a little hole in our bag of veggies. So we're watching these things like hawks. I think they're called Wekas, Wekas? 
uh, yeah, little flightless bird. It's a scavenger. So we're gonna keep an eye out for him. Campsite, chicken korma, or not chicken korma, just korma with some veggies. The funny thing is, I think this is more of the more elaborate meals we've made since we've been in New Zealand. And we're doing it at our campsite. But there's nothing else to do, so why not? Any thoughts about today? Uh, I'd say it was a great day. It was a beautiful day to kayak. The seals were awesome. And I think I'm gonna like camping here. We got a good spot, I can see the ocean. Had a good dinner. We'll see if these birds steal any of our stuff. <laughs> but I'd say it's been a great day. Went for a walk before bed. Even though we can't watch the sunset, the colors are just unreal. You be in the film. Good morning. I'd say it wasn't the best quality sleep I've had. But quantity was good. I think we went to bed at like 9 and it's like 7.30. So that's 10 and a half hours of sleep. Mosquito Bay is living up to its name. There's so many of them. I can just, yeah. They're waiting for us. Mm, yeah. Mm. I'm going to delay getting out of this tent as long as I can. Okay, so the mosquitoes look really bad. So my plan is to have as little skin uncovered as possible. <laughs> but I feel like it's gonna be my luck. The one's just gonna fly in here and then just keep biting me. So we'll see, but I think we gotta get out. There's a lot we wanna see today. And it's already 7.30. Okay, so we made it through some interesting waves to get into Sandfly Bay. <laughs> we surfed a little bit, but our guide yesterday were, scared us a little bit. He was like, even if you're an expert, uh, it's easy to get turned over when you're trying to surf. So we were a little conservative on that. Maybe we should have taken a little more risks. Uh, but we're headed to the swinging bridge. I think the tide is going to be high enough that we can paddle right under it. Then hopefully we can get out and go across it. This bridge is awesome. Okay, so if you were kayaking, I'll show you when we're down there, but when you're looking at the bridge coming in from the ocean, uh, on your left-hand side, there's a little path. You can dock your kayak there. It's a short little hike up to here and it's totally worth it. So you gotta come up to the swinging bridge. Uh, it's beautiful from below, but it's worth coming up to the top. So on the left-hand side of the bridge, if you're coming in from the ocean, there's this little path right here. You can tie off your kayak and it's a short, less than five minute hike up to 
the bridge. So we parked our kayak up Torrent Bay. Um, and now we're walking up to find the track, the trail, and we're gonna head toward Cleopatra's Pools. Uh, the only thing that's worrying us a bit is the tide is starting to go out, and we paddled pretty far back into this bay. So, if the tide goes out completely and we're stuck here, it's gonna be a long slog pulling that kayak and all of our camping gear back to deeper water. So we're gonna make some good time, I hope, but it's nice to see it from a different vantage point. So Cleopatra Pools, they have this natural water slide. Let's check it out. So we're leaving Anchorage Bay and we're headed to what our map calls the Mad Mile. So we'll see, it's currently pretty unprotected and we got easterly winds. So that's on shore here. So could get interesting. Waves are certainly starting to get a little bit more choppy. We'll see how this goes. No seals, but it's a pretty island. There's a lot of boats. There's a lot more people in the southern part, it seems like, of the park. It's a little windy. <laughs> and I think we might get into the water for just a few minutes. Too much. So we have oh. all the rations. <laughs> so we have a fried chicken sandwich, which looks amazing. And Not chicken, fish. Fish, fish sandwich, right? And then this is a mussel patty. I really don't know what to expect. I guess we feast. We made a dent. A big dent. We've got about a three hour drive ahead of us, so we're gonna hit the road. Mm. One more. <laughs> 